Hello everyone, in this video lecture we are going to understand about humors from soil microbiology. Let's start with introduction. In soil science, that was humus was derived in 1790 in between the 800. From the Latin humus, earth, ground, dominates the fraction of soil organic matter that is amorphous and without the cellular structure, characteristics of plants, microorganisms and animals. Humus significantly affects the bulk density of soil and contributes to its retention of moisture and nutrients. Although terms humus and compost are informally used interchangeably, they are distinct soil components with different origins. Humus is created through anaerobic fermentation while compost is the result of aerobic decomposition. It is also used to describe topsoil origin that contains organic matter which includes humus type, humus form and humus profile. Now see the humus word was the Latin word and which was derived in 1790-1800 era and which means the earth ground. Now see the humus and the compost these words are totally used interchangeably but these are total vary from each other because the humus is created under anaerobic condition while compost is created under aerobic condition. Let's start with definition. Now see a precise definition of humus is rather difficult. Humus is a mass of resistant residual organic matter formed as a result of decomposition and the synthesis of organic matter under soil conditions. It is a generally brownish black waxy material which is known as the fat of the land. It varies greatly in composition which depends on the different factors. First factor is the materials from which it is made such as constants of dead and living plant and animal cells. Second factor is that the interconversion of materials by the agency of various types of microorganisms. And third factor is that the environmental conditions under which the organisms are working such as temperature, moisture, pH, aeration, soil reaction, etc. Now see the composition of soil is very from so the composition of humus is very from soil to soil. It is very complex but it is mainly made of from carbon and nitrogen known as lignoprotein. Beside this it also contains a number of inorganic salts such as phosphates and potash. Now the function of humus. First point it maintains the physical condition of soil. It improves the physical condition of soil making it soft and mellow. It increases the water holding capacity and aerates the soil. With this soil became sticky and resist erosion. The second function is that it maintains chemical conditions of the soil such as the solubility of soil, rock minerals, the oxidation reduction reaction and the buffering capacity. Third point the stores house of the chemicals means it is a great storehouse of food materials for higher plants. It holds and slowly releases nitrogen, phosphorus, minerals and also CO2 under the action of microorganisms. They also helps to maintain the biological diversity in the soil which ultimately helps to the soil fertility and the plant growth. So this is all about the humus. Thanks a lot.